I live in Holland, in the Netherlands, uh, originally from the UK, from Birmingham, but uh, moved to Holland 35 years ago, started to work in a seed company. We had been working on Echinaceas. Of course, as you know, that it's mainly wild form is purple or white, but we started to work on separate colors. And we had several really interesting colors. And one of them was a, a green with a pink ring and also just a, a straight green. And I love this, I like green flowers. My colleagues think I'm crazy, but I just love the green color. I really thought this would be a, a, a great plant to select. And everybody else says, no, it's not interesting. But I, I really, I pushed, I said, no, this, we've got to do this one too. I was about to retire. At the end of the meeting, one, a friend of mine called Antoine, he, he says, Alan, please come out to the front. So I came out to the front and he, he started to tell a story about how he'd got to know me six years ago and how he'd love to travel with me and how I was passionate about flowers. And he says, I know you like the green egg in his say, and I thought, what's going on here? And then he said, we've decided to call it Alan's Pride. And he gave me a photo with the name on it and my picture. And I thought, wow, is this happening to me? It's the first time I'd never had a, pl a plant named after me. And there it was. <laughs> and I've got to say, it's one of the most beautiful plants that I've seen. I have it in my garden. I love to see it. I, yeah, I don't know. Green flowers, they're so unusual. They're so beautiful. Yeah, I tell you, if you grow this, you'll love it.